everyone, thank you so much for joining us again. Today, we have another new product to show you guys. Introducing the new quickers by LBA DIY Lashes. These are an excellent option during the lash breaks because they look just like lash extensions. We have four gorgeous styles to show you. If you want to see how I apply these beautiful lashes, then please keep watching. Day 9 is one of the sets that is considered for volume or hybrid sets. So if you're looking to do something like that, this is the perfect set to go for. This is how it comes. And I'm going to be doing one eye with it and one eye without it so we can see the difference. And in this one, I'm going to be doing a cat eye. So to start, I always kind of like curl them a little bit. So I'm going to go ahead and curl the lashes a little bit slightly, not too much. I just want to make sure that the curl is like right when I do it. And then I go ahead and with a lash brush, I brush the lashes very well so they're like separated since I'm gonna be doing like a cat eye I'm gonna start from the end of the side with the longest size that we have in the box and then I'm gonna slowly go with the smaller a smaller smaller so I'm gonna be showing you how to do it. the kit comes with the glue and the bonder so first you're gonna get the the, the bonder and it comes like in a little this is kind of like a little mascara wand. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna apply underneath these kind of lashes. You apply them underneath the lashes and that's why it gives that natural extension look because the falsies, you put it on the top so it has a strip on it. That's why they kind of look false. <laughs> this one look more natural and it, that's why it gives that eyelash extension vibe. So we go ahead, we be putting the glue then we're gonna apply it on our eyelashes so i'm gonna do it by sections okay so you don't apply the whole eye you just do one section at a time so i go ahead and i apply a fairly amount like brushing like if you're applying mascara then you let it there then you pick your lash so with the with the little of the tweezer the little bump side you put it up and then you take the lash in between so now you're gonna go ahead, take the lash close by. Then you take the lash and you put it as close. We place them as close to the lash line as we can and we softly press to it. So they glue to the natural lashes. And there, we have one of the lashes on the end. So remember, I'm gonna do cat eye. Cat eye is always goes from uh, bigger from the outside, slower to the inside. So now we get the bonds again, and we're gonna do the other section. So here we do it like this, like again, like if you were brushing your lashes with the mascara. Then we take the next size. So in this case, it's number twelve. This one was number 14, this is 12. I always like to like press my eyes so I can see it more. Uh, you don't have to, you can just do like that, but I just like to see that I'm very close to the lash line. And then you drop the lash there. You just make sure it's not in your lash, like in your eye. And then softly tap it. And then you go ahead again with the tweezer. You can even go from the inside out. And you tap. So you see that now it's like it's lower and this is the bigger part. That's how the cut eye is. Okay, so that was the second lash. Now we're gonna go with the third lash. So again, we get the bond. We dip it inside very well. We get it out. And we go with the third section. So in this one, again, like you're brushing your lashes with the mascara, making sure all the lashes get the glue. And then the next size is 10. And then you hold it steady. Then you go to your eye. 
again I press it a little bit so I can see from underneath and then you just drop the lashes down. Then you go ahead with the same tweezer huh? and then you do like a soft tapping. They glue together so that's one eye with I like with the uh, DIY lashes and this eye is without it so now I'm gonna do the inner inner corner but because I'm very sensitive I cannot have it very close to my uh, waterline so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get the lash and I'm gonna cut it in half so practically I'm just gonna fit the amount that I need for my eye I just get one little tweezers scissors I just get a little scissors and then I just go ahead and I cut the part that I don't need this one you can save it for your next eye and then I just get like a very tiny piece that is gonna go in our inner eye so this one I'm gonna leave it ready to go and then I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna apply the bond on that inner corner so that one is a little bit more tricky because it's kind of like inside or waterline so I don't want to go too close because it's going to make your eyes watery. So what you're going to do is like just apply it very slightly. And even if you go over the lashes that you already have there, it's fine. So you go ahead with the brush. I pick the brush like upwards. And then I apply here. I don't, I kind of leave like two millimeters out of my waterline. So it's my, that's my safe area. And then I go ahead, take the lashes, and then I apply the little piece there. So you kind of complete the look a little bit more, but it's not so close to mine. And then I just softly tap it, just make sure it goes there. You just give it a couple seconds so the glue that also a little bit and it dries so it doesn't glue to your tweezers and there you have it this is day night set had I one eye with it one eye without it so for our next DIY lashes we're gonna be the everyday classic these ones are ideal for people that want to have like look with lash extensions but at the same time they don't Maybe for someone that has like a small lashes, so it's ideal for them and it doesn't look that uh, bald. So I'm gonna be showing you the doll eye set. This one, it goes smaller in the middle and it goes small, uh, smaller to the side and it's smaller to the inner side. So it's kind of like, um, how do you say abanico? Uh, like the one that like your, when you blow air? No, the one that is like this, hand fan. So the set looks like an air fan longer in the middle, shorter to the outside, and shorter to the inside. Let's go. So now that I decided to do the natural look at the doll eye that is longer in the middle and shorter to the outside and to the inner side, now I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna kind of divide my eye inch, like in the middle, so I'm gonna decide which, like, what's the longer size of lash that is gonna go there. So I just take a look at the eye, so I think this is my middle over here. So my middle I decided when you curl the lashes prior to the application of DIY lashes, this will allow you to have like a better look just because the lashes are going to stick better. Especially in these kind of lashes that I have, they are like super straight. So it's better to always curl them prior to the application. This looks like a little mascara one. My eyelashes. I'm going to pick number 14 just because my natural lashes are long but if you don't want them that long you can go with a smaller size so the next size is 12 so I'm gonna pick up the lash with my hand then I'm gonna put it in the tweezer and I'm gonna go ahead and this is the middle part of my eye where I already applied the glue and you see how easy they stick I just give them like a little push And that's it. Then I go ahead with the tweezer and I kind of pinch them. 
that they stay in place. Chin is so easy. I then I go from underneath and I press them down. I brush them just so there you go. They're like all the same. And there you have it. For our next DIY lashes, we're gonna do the glammy party. The name says it all because it's very dramatic. It's the one with most volume of all of the packages that we have available. So I'm gonna be showing you a design. This time we're gonna do it kind of like a cat eye, but it's called dull eye. I believe so. So it's kind of like in the longer in the middle like on the outside but you don't start right in the outside you start a little bit like one third of the eye more in the outside so i'm going to show you how this one's go from number 10 to number 16 so i'm going to be using 16 14 and 12. so these lashes have like spikes so each of them have like a little spikes so that's why i give that dramatic look so i like it Press it softly. And ta -da. There you have them. Very easy to apply and so fast. That's what I would do without it. The good thing with the sectionals is if we miss like a little spot or it's like looking like not as dramatic, you can always add some of the lashes underneath. So it gives that drama that you want them to be looking at and it looks very natural. So this is the Glammy Party set on one eye and then this one is without it. So this time we're going to use the walk up like this. These are one of the classic lashes. Like the name of the set says, you walk up like this. This looks very natural. This is for like an everyday kind of look. So I'm going to be showing you, I'm going to be doing um, two longer in the middle and then I'm going to go and then I'm going to open it. Okay, so I hope you guys like it. This time I kind of go with my natural lash length. So the box comes from size 10 all the way up to size 16. Uh, this time I'm going to be... I'm not going to be using the 16, I'm only going to use 14, so it looks more natural and more casual. I'm on the middle of my lashes, with the one beside, very softly on them, just to make sure they're like... And voila, one eye without it, one eye with it. The DIY lashes also come in these adorable kits that come with the lashes, the tweezers, and the glue. So I will highly recommend the kit for beginners. Thank you so much again for watching this video. If you have any questions about how to use the DIY lashes, please leave us a comment down below. We have always appreciated your likes and your comments. You can also purchase the DIY lashes on our website at lbaprofessional.com. The link will be in the description box. See you next time.